Now, real wrestling doesn't have a junior division, but Encephalon does, and they're specifically trained to, um, you know, not have as hard um, moves and stuff, and I believe the age is um, 10 to, uh, can't be too far up, 10 to 16 maybe, 10 to 15. So in order to make a household full of children, I had to make this teenager and make him really small and try to make him look like he's a younger child. So he's supposed to be, I don't know, like probably 16 or so. And he is half dog. He is, has he's like half bulldog or something and he's spotted. And I think he likes pastels. So his name is Kato, the Wonder Hound. And he is optimistic. Woof. And obviously, since he's smaller, he's all buckled and stuff, so... Bark. And this is his wrestling attire. He paints his nose to make himself look more like a dog. And it seems he doesn't wear makeup except for wrestling, is that it? Or does he wear eyeliner? No, he doesn't. So he only puts the eyeliner and the blush on for his attire and sleepy e -haw! I don't I don't really know what I was thinking here but <laughs> swim 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 and if you notice most of his clothes are torn up in some way not this because he's a doge and he likes the wildlife, and he just runs around being a doge. <sighs> that's part of the shirt. Okay, that's part of the shirt. Yes. This is Candy King, or Steph Gordy. And he likes pastel also. So he's a bit younger. It was really difficult to try and find good male child clothing. Nobody makes good male child clothing. Like bright colors. Boys clothing is so boring. Do you have braces? He has braces. So I really had to try and go with it myself. Now, the wings are by Jenny Sims. Again, notorious for texture problems. So they are in the hat area. I am going to fix that. When I fix that, the hat will be like this. So, I'd have to press undo a bunch of times. So, um, he is the candy king. Sleepy. Oh, I love when child custom hair turns... It's supposed to be pink, but it goes to the first color for some reason. Sometimes. But luckily, the pink is already saved, so... Oh, and he likes animals! I forgot that! He really likes animals. So he's got a little necklace with a cat. And... Okay, so obviously those pajamas, and he likes pink. And he has cat headphones, and he put cat face paint on him, and he has a candied apple, and he's happy, and he's super cute. And he has cat sunglasses. And then he's got the biggest can I've ever seen. More kitty cat glasses. Um, his necklace again. And then, again, just, I don't have a large selection of boys' clothing. Or children's clothing, anyway. So that's Candy King. This is Ergen Hyperspeed. And he is some kind of reptile. Or something. No, he's an alien. He's some kind of alien. 
yes, he is an alien. So here are his eyes. What do your teeth look like? Okay, so that's using my mouth color, and I need to make darker swatches. So I'm not sure what his attire is themed of. I think he... Hmm. I'm not really sure what's going on. So this is his wrestling stuff. And you can see that he has all of these little markings and stuff. Uh, he is Ergen Hyperspeed! I feel like I should recolor Seriously's goggles to make a white version. And these are um, accessory tights, and something's going on with the crotch that I'm going to have to take a look at. Hyperspeed. And he's an alien, so look at how buff he is! He's just, he's ripped. He's like <laughs> Gohan or Goten or Trunks. <laughs> and then this is supposed to be a sleep attire, like he's put into a, a some kind of alien thing to recharge him or something to help something. Aliens. <laughs> and that swim. Yeah, I, I I think I just chose a bunch of random clothes. Yeah. Okay, this is Torek the Warrior. And he's some kind of monster thing. Um and his species is what? Somebody didn't move the mesh into the head. I don't know what's causing those. He's some kind of monster. Um, his species is um, some kind of tribal thing. So I tried to, you know, make him as monsterish as possible. Give him spots and stuff. Give him four eyes. He is Torak the warrior. His gimmick is that, you know, he's a warrior from his tribe. And he likes white, apparently. And, um... So this is his attire, and he's wearing, like, gold makeup and stuff. And eyeliner. Um, and then he has a glowy thing in his hand, because they have some kind of power. Um, and he glows when using that power, so it enables him to, you know help him be strong and there's all sorts of little specks that's a part of the mesh that the person was supposed to hide but didn't hide so I really like the way his makeup looks it's sort of like um Cleopatra I said sleep then party and swim you know, and he's also kind of built, because he's a monster. No! Okay, well, that's winter. Why didn't I put a hat on him? Were, were his ears causing trouble, or are his... Oh, his horns are skin details. So, he doesn't get a hat? I don't know, but this is the hot weather. He's got all those spots on him. And this is Drama Queen, or Ama Robin. And she has a body preset that's supposed to be like for preteens. So it's supposed to make the children look more like preteens. So she's a little older. So she's probably like 13 going on 14 and she's probably a heel right now but yeah that's drama queen I think she likes purple what do her eyes look like oh her eyes are super shiny 
she's got a little heart beauty mark right there. So as you can see, the preteen's more curvy um, and has, you know, developing chest, trying to make her look like she is developing. There's a preteen male body that I was going to give Torak, but if I had the preteen body, I couldn't have the arms. So, oh, that's right. I haven't finished her yet. Okay. So I haven't finished that division yet. Let me go ahead and delete this. And I updated Cherry. Oh, hello, Todd. Yeah, I updated Cherry because when I first made her, I didn't have, you know, very much custom content. But now that I do, I was able to make her look a little more like the drawing I made of her. And use different hairs. Make her eyes nice and shiny. Uh, I'm going to fix that <laughs> because this is takes the um... <laughs> now did this take the hat texture or did this take the hair texture I don't know but the backpack is over going over it and I hate brand name things so I want to edit the mesh with the brand name stuff and take the brand names away sleepy sleepy Probably going to recolor these socks to make them look more like socks. The shadow is really dark. These were made by Stormy. Ah. And as soon as I found this hair, I was like, oh my god, I love it! I'm probably going to recolor the surfboard. I had a hard time with hats uh, for head accessories because I wanted her to carry these bags and the bags are in the hat hmm. texture area, so... I'm snuggly, wuggly, warm. Warm, 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 warm. So that's it. And my husband's going to be home soon, so I should end this. So, um, leave a like on this video if you want me to start doing my own videos again. Um, Evelyn's not going anywhere right now. Um, she's just busy, you know, with her job and, you know, with her friends and everything. She's got a life. It's, it's not a job. The YouTube channel isn't a job for her. It's a hobby. Um, frankly, it's kind of become my hobby too, ever since the, ever since you can hardly make money on it. So, um, leave a like on this video if you want to see more of vid videos by me. Um, I'm still having the comments turned off. Um, it's still not entirely safe, I don't think, even though people have been leaving me alone. Um, and if you like my content or Evelyn's content, content, subscribe, spread the word of awesome, become a Raytonite. Don't forget to click the little bell, and I shall see you later, alligators and crocodiles. Goodbye!